Welcome back. I must apologize, first off, for the shortness of the previous episode. You see, at times, I have to go off and do things to prevent me from recording. It was cut short, unfortunately. I would have thrown it out, but, well, the rock was already exploded, and I couldn't unexplode it, so that's that, then. What I was saying was, a figure moves in the light, but I don't see any figure moving. It looks like just one figure just not moving at all, actually. And that's what it looks like, indeed. To me as well, for Sly. And that was your point in this explosion. No, no, no. Learn to relish the explosion itself. The explosion in and of itself was worth it. In and of itself? You're talking like me now. You should I can say self. Yes, well. Hold on. Hold on, do you see something? This right here, is this a cave? No. It's just a dark spot. Look at this. This? No, there's nothing else here, apparently. Student, that we should try to search every piece of ground. I'm hungry. I want to eat more mushrooms. We have to find a journal for William as well. Ooh, a key. The keys are put up here. And as are the bombs. I wonder what would happen if we put both there. So I'm not sure it really much matters. Imagine they would coexist peacefully. Why not? What's this? This whole washout looks unstable. Hmm. This whole washout looks unstable. It appears to be a cave that's too dark. I wonder if the only caves that are illuminatable are the ones that have little blue mushrooms in them. Hmm, that's a thought. Interesting. So that sign is telling us that this whole land has holes in it. A pink she's trapped in frost. We should have shamed the bomb for her. Well, well Sly, it might not have been a good idea because, you know, it might have blown her up as well. No. Perhaps we can find a way to make the sun come in here. Blow up the surrounding terrain. Melt the frost. Somehow. Oh, let's open his chest. Booyah. You found an elemental omni. Omni. Is that how it's pronounced? Post in the comments. These are usually placed above omni poles. Used by the gnomes to attract spirits. I think we need to find an Omnipole if we want to attract some spirits. It press escape to clear. Nothing we can do for her. Our elemental won't help her. Unless we can find a fire elemental. If that even makes any sense in that context. A mushroom. Oh, a secret little passageway. That's convenient. Yeah. Doesn't show up on the map, does it, Sly? Just you and I. Just that little secret, isn't it? It's cool how all the special places are saved on the map automatically. And I think we've seen everything here. There was to see. <clears throat> Let's go to this cave. 
No disillusion here, it's just a dark cave. Mushroom. Roots. How did that happen? I don't know, Sai. This yours is a strange world. But there's nothing that's not the strangest thing here, I will say. Can I make it back up there? I can. Yeah, another shortcut. With that, those rune stones, it's going to be hard to trans teleport ourselves. We can't, actually. That's right, Sly. We'll have to do this uh, the good old-fashioned way. We'll have to walk. Or run, if you prefer. You seem to prefer the run. That's good. I'm a patient man. But, um... Running is just a lot... Just a lot, it looks better, it's, you know, for everyone else. I assume not everyone in the audience may be patient, so. Did you see that chest? Hold on, let me go mark it on the map real quick. We have to go locate its exact position by standing over it. Alright then, if that is the requirement. We can do that then, right? And so I'm heading there now. It's as fast as I can go. And... Here we go. Oh, I missed. I missed it. I don't know how I could do better. Sly, Hansa, you did the best you could now. The best it's possible. One day, though, we'll find you some wings. Some wings? Like in my dream? Will it come true? Can you make my dream come true? Yes, Sly. Parts of it, at least. Watch this. Is it... Is it the... Uh, Omnipole? Press down to make fire. Uses three fairy flies. Okay. There they go. Is that fire? Firefox? What what did that mean? I'm on fire? Oh, that's pretty neat, isn't it? I hope I'm not supposed to be murdering something right now because if that's the case Oh oh I have an idea. I have an idea. Oh, it's gone. But I've got an idea, though. What if I took my fire to the frost fairy? To the fairy encapsulated in frost. Let me get some fairy flies. Let's do this again. Press down to make fire. It is very fortunate that this, is, that this can be done multiple times. All right, let's go. I'm on fire. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the fairy. A pixie, whatever her name is. I think it's a pixie. We need to melt her the frost that, that imprisons her. We're almost there, Sly. Keep burning. Well done, Sly. We, we got the pixie out. What, what's this? She looks kind of like me, almost. Aren't we weird? Hello, Pixie. How's it going? Do I get anything for saving you? Do I... Is it related to the Omnipole? Do I... Would you like me to... Like... I've got the little red omni thing used by the gnomes. I got it out of this chest. Do you? 
Are you going to follow me or something? You are? Oh, you're following me? Oh, thank you. Thank you, Pixie. Well, how'd you go through that? Alright, Pixie. We'll go and do stuff together then. Follow me like the fairy flies, or... I guess not, because you, you don't... You jump like I do, except you can double jump. And I guess fly. It's kind of cool. Alright, well that's going to end this episode. Well done, Sly. You've done well. That's enough for now, I think. And you. You who's watching this. You've done well by finding yourself here. Watching all of this. Well done. Well done. I'm, I'm a little bit envious that you get to watch this for the first time. I'll watch this, but it won't be the same because I've been here before. But you get to watch this. For the first time. You can focus on what's happening instead of focus on what you're doing. I envy you. Goodbye, for now.